What's up, Snez and hey friendos, welcome back to The Strain 2! Last episode, we finally met Agony, but well, we're looking for hope, so that was a bust. We are now in Chapter 2, Lost. Okay, where am I now? And whose dog is that? Is that Mr. Taylor's dog? It looks like it. Hmm. Hey, aren't you Mr. Taylor's dog? Who's a good girl? Aw, you look a lot cuter when you're not, you know, eating deer. Hope's Domain, we're in Hope's Domain again. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a nightmare dream. So, have you seen Mr. Taylor anywhere? I forgot your name, little doggo. Do you know where Hope is? Hmm, what's that, girl? Oh, you want me to fish? Well, there seems to be a fishing rod on board. Press S to fish. Aha! Pay attention to your rod once a fish starts biting, quickly press E. Right. Paying attention. We have a fish! To stop fishing, press W. Okie dokie. Hey, I got a fish! You know, my father used to take me fishing. Happy childhood memories. Okay, let's get a little farther. Let me know once more when you see fish, girl. Onwards! Although, I don't want to fish out any gruesome monsters. But that's eventually gonna happen. It's getting foggier and foggier. What the fuck is that? Hello? Hi, honey. Did you get any fish yet? Yes, I did. Wonderful. In that case, I'll start preparing some potatoes. Um, okay. It's such lovely weather. But it's getting dark, so please come home soon. You have fun now, honey. Aha, uh -huh, thank you. It was the girl again. I don't recognize her voice. Well, I might as well do a bit more fishing. Fishing! We're gonna grab something creepy, aren't we? Hmm, I'm watching you. Oh wait, I accidentally pressed W. We need to fish one more time. Watching you. I know what you're up to. Aha, we got some fish. Okay, onwards. Onwards we go. Wait, that's not onwards, that's backwards. Hmm. Right. Can we land now? Are we safely home? We're safely home. And that is our cottage. Right? What is it, girl? Good spot again, huh? Mm-hmm. Of course it's a good spot again. What do you see now, girl? What are we gonna pick up? A head? Mm -hmm. I'm watching you. Still a fish. Okay. Okay, game. You're giving us a sense of relief and comfort. You're not debating us, huh? You're totally not debating us. Did we go this way? Where are we going? No, we can't go this way. Do we just roll backwards? Apparently, we just row backwards. I was sort of half expecting the dog to disappear when we go in there. Are we home? Can we leave? I don't want to stay in this creepy pond any longer. Hello? We'll have to pick that up. Honey, are you coming home soon? It's getting dark. You know I always get nervous if you're on the lake after dark. Yeah, I'm getting nervous too. Okay, I'm heading back now. I've got plenty of fish. Okay, honey, see you soon. Alright, let's head back home, girl. Yeah. Now we getting creepy. Creepy, creepy, creepy. You know, I'm not sure what this place is. I don't understand how I got here. Or how you got here. But I'm glad you're with me. Still. This whole journey. Is this some kind of limbo? Moments like this make me think. Did I make a horrible mistake? 
Okay, let's just hope the little doggo doesn't turn into a creepy monster while we row back. It's getting really silent. Getting really silent, girl. Yay, we're back home. We are safe and sound. Whoa, who are you? You don't look like my wife. Tell me why you're here. Self-loathing. I don't think I'm a bad person. But I've hurt so many people for my own self-gain. Tell me about it. Well, I've done everything by the book. I mean, I've done nothing illegal, just my job. But it involved dealing with people who were in desperate need of help. And yet I took away their last hope. Even though it's alright according to the law. Yes, I'm well aware of the nature of your work. I see a conflict between you and your work self. You must see it yourself. Yeah, I do. So, do you think you're doing anything to contribute to this problem? I tried. But I'm afraid I've crossed the point of no return. See, I went to resign to change the course of my future. But at that very last day, I got to sign on as a partner with this company. My backbone snapped like a dry stick and so I kept going. Interesting. You're aware of the conflict, but you decided to ignore it. Sure, you got the partnership, but there's more to it. Ah, our time seems to be up, Mr. Price. I'd like to talk about your childhood the next time we meet. I'm sure we can find some answers from there. Hmm. Interesting. Where are we now? Billboard. Uh, okay. Where am I now? Somewhere beyond part two. Sure, of course. Is this Mr. Taylor's house again? It feels like it. Ribbon from memory. Huh, the safe. Someone put a ribbon on the safe. I need to figure out the combination. Hide? We have to hide again? Mm. Game! Anything over here? Washing machine? This door? Hello? The old house. Enter. It's locked from the other side. Oh. Oh my, that is a haunted house if I've ever seen one. Welp, Resident Evil, here we go. Oh, it is a puzzle. You have to put it together, okay. But what does it show? What is this puzzle supposed to show? Ah, we're supposed to put that there. Let's put that here. This over there. Wait, is that it? Am I correct? No. And I think this should be it. There we go. Okay, that looks correct. It's missing a piece though. Huh. Where do we get the piece? The fuck is that? Whoa! Hi! Are you the red gaze again? You don't look like the red gaze. Let's go and see what you are. Are you a memory? You're a childhood memory, aren't you? Huh, one of these things again. I feel dizzy. Back to the past we go. Childhood memory, birthday. Hooray. Mom, I want a cake. Don't be silly, honey. We'll cut the cake once your friends come by later. But we don't have friends, Mom. Are you sure they're coming? Yes, I'm sure. Um, okay then. But before that, we need to tidy your room. Okay, Dad, I will tidy up after breakfast. What are my old ears hearing? You promise? I promise I'll tidy my room. That's great, honey. That's exactly how big boys like you behave. Oh, Dad. Did you have something for our boy? Yes, Mom. I believe I have something here behind my back. Ooh, a present. Happy birthday, son. Happy birthday, honey. What's in the box? Uh, what's in the box? Go ahead and open it. What's in the box? Whoa! Constructor set number 649. This is the best present ever. I love you, Mom and Dad. Oh my. Hmm. 
At least Agony didn't mess that memory up. I remember my birthday. How I miss my parents. Hmm. Do we have the last piece? We don't have the last piece. We need the missing piece. Where do we find the missing piece? In here. Still locked. Somewhere beyond. Ribbon from memory. Wait, this is the ribbon from the memory. Oh! So the present must be in here somewhere. Hmm. Right? In the washing machine? Instructor said 649. Could it be that simple? Six, four, nine. Aha! What's this? A rusty old piece? Surely it has a place. Yes! This is the last piece of the puzzle. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Time to hide. Screw this. Hello? Yeah, okay. Sure. Old house. Puzzle piece. Into the old house we go. Is this our childhood house? It probably is. Ah! What sort of image is that anyway? And somehow that unlocked the door. Gotta love that logic. In we go. Anyone home? The grandfather clock. And the safe spot is this way. This place seems familiar. It reminds me of my childhood home. Safe spot? There we go. Now let's examine things. The grandfather clock. Hi. It's an old clock that's missing a pendulum. We need to find the pendulum and we can hide in there. For reasons I don't want to know about. Hmm, can we go outside? Four ways. Four ways. Anything in here? Ew. Ah. I think that goes back out again. Why are there multiple hiding places in this house? God damn it. My oldest friend. No, not in here. Washing machine. Toys. Can't interact with any of these. Okay. So we're in four ways. We still have to check the door. The door, the door, the door, this door. The Red Gaze Part 4. Hmm. Hmm. Red Gaze, where are you? What's this? Huh? What's this? We found this thing. This will be useful. A bulb. Okie dokie. Hmm, that's it. No red gaze staring at us from the dark. Oh, okay, there you were. I was just thinking about you. Did you miss me as much as I did? No? Okie dokie. Sure. Right. Out we go. So where do we put the bulb? Hmm. There has to be a place where we could put the bulb. Oh my fucking god, something is in the background. Woo there. Okay. Hmm. Maybe we have to go around the place while avoiding that dude. Great. That's gonna be fun. Can we use a bulb anywhere in here? No? Okay. Hmm. He's in the other side! Well, we have to go towards there anyway. I need comfort. Aha! We can put the bulb here. Time to light this place up. Hmm, ah, what is this? I need to find a fuse. We need a fuse, we need a fuse. Where can we find a fuse? This house reminds me of my childhood home. All those valuable memories. But they're a thing of the past, so what's the point anymore? Oh, fucking hell, goddammit! Oi! Comfort! Try to think positive. Maybe you could forge new happy memories. God damn it, Comfort! I did not ask for your opinion. Also, your vodka. A place on the stone. We're outside now, but where do we find a fuse? Examine. Hello? There, it's not locked anymore. Ah, it's a shortcut. Okay. What is this? There's so much light! 
It looks like an altar that's missing something. So we need a fuse and some sort of offering now. Great game, great. What are we offering to? Agony. Agony seems like he has too much power in this place. We need to put Hope back in power. But where do we find a fuse? Fuse, 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 fuse. Hmm. We don't know where to find a fuse. We're back at four ways. Let's go back to the main lobby. Back to where this fucker was. Where are you? We're back at the grandfather clock. Nothing over here. That's the door. Can we go out? Hmm. Maybe we could still go out. Anything by the clock? It's also missing the pendulum. Where do we find the fucking pendulum? Say first. Right. Hmm. There seems to be some sort of door in the background here, or it's just the wallpaper getting peeled off. That's what a bunch of blood does, hidden in the darkness. Right. So we got the bulb here. It's a lampstand. One that's missing a bulb. Maybe... Hey, wait. Hidden in the darkness. What if there was something in the background here that we needed the bulb for? What if I just grabbed that bulb without looking for the item? Let's grab the bulb again. Where did we leave that fuck? Bulb, bulb, bulb. Where did we leave the bulb? Did we leave it here? Need comfort? Hmm. That's missing a fuse. I'm grabbing you. There we go. We'll go back here. See if anything was in the dark before we took the bulb. Wait. Is this the right place? No, this is not the right place. So we're in four ways. Wait, was it here? Need comfort. No, this is where we put that thing. This leads outside. Yeah, that leads outside. Let's circle back around. There might be something we miss outside. Let's go through here. The old house. I was correct. Hmm. Hmm. So we enter back here. We're back at the grandfather clock. We can enter through here. This is four ways. Is there anything that we could interact with? Nope. Let's go past the clock. Can we put a bulb inside this place? Nope. That doesn't work. Safe spot is here, nothing past it. Where did we find this bulb originally? Yeah, here. Okay. So we light this. Was there anything? Aha! Huh? There's a hole in the wall behind the couch. I couldn't see it before. Hmm. A hole in the wall. What's in here? He's calling for me. Who's calling for me? I will not reciprocate any of your calls. Examine. Great, another one of these puzzles. We spent 10 minutes on the last one. Ah, wait, now we spin these. Sure. That goes there. This goes there. Spins around. This looks like an anchor. Is this all right? No, that's not how that goes. Aha! And then... That should be it. An anchor! What does that mean? And what's that clacking? What did we find? A pendulum! I think I know where to put this! Yeah! Bah! Hi! You were in the audience last time we saw you! Can you get out of our way, please? Thank you. Goodbye. Now we grab this bulb. I said grab it. 
Let's go back over here, back to the room. We can save first. Gotta save in case, I don't know, the shadow monster attacks us and then we die. We put the pendulum, pendulum, pendulum over here. TikTok, motherfucker. That's it. What does that do? What does that do? Hello? Do we just hide? It does nothing. What's the point of this clock? Let's go check the other rooms out, I guess. Oh, there you go. You activated your mystic powers when we weren't looking. God damn it. Aha, I knew it. I knew there was a door back there. I am such a genius. I totally knew there was a door here. And what's in door number, ooh, with sand. Wait, let there be light. Hello. Aha, fuse box. Mine now. Collecting fuses is a hobby of mine. Grab you. Then we grab you. Ah, fucking hell! God damn it, greed! You asshole! Son of a bitch, greed! Didn't need to spook us like that. Hey! Where are you going? Go away, greed. Now you're just saying things that you don't even mean. Take me with you again. I'll show you the way. Mm-hmm. Tempting, is it not? Forget reason, that old fool. He's all bark and no bite, always talking and never doing. You think he can help you? I think. I... I don't know. See? Take a look and see where being humble has taken you. Take my hand and we will bow to no one. But you also played a role in my downfall. I don't want to walk that path once again. You fool. You're weak. You think you can resist me? <laughs> yeah. I'm your addiction. No matter what, I will always be there. Yes, you're my addiction. But I made a mistake and confused you with ambition. I won't let you out. We will see about that. Bye, Greed. Was not nice to see you again. Greed. Will he ever leave me be? That's up to you. He's part of your psyche. Grandfather clock. Oh, shit, fierce creature. Great, he's back. Hi there, friend, though. You want a hug? Oh, shit, the gorillas are blocking the way. Well, we'll probably just wait for you to pass by, right? I'm gonna fucking hide here in my safe spot. You can just roam on by, you shadowy asshole. Oh my, nope, 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 we're not in here. We're not in here, you dick. Shoot, bye bye You can talk to any one of those gorilla boys. Yeah, that's right. Bye bye Bye, asshole. See you later. Okay, he's gone. Can we step out? Hmm. Hi. I'm guessing you're blocking the way out. Sure, you can do that. Just do you, gorilla boys. Four ways. Then we go through here. I need comfort. We put the bulb. There we go. And now we grab our fuse. Put it in here. Okay, I got the fuse. Aha, uh -huh. and that does... Ooh. To the attic we go. Another memory. What happened to my friend? Your friend? Huh, another one of these... these things. It's so hypnotic. Childhood memory, moving house. Oh, we had a racer bed. I never had a racer bed. Did you pack your toys yet, honey? Um, I'm doing it now, Mom. Pack our toys, pack our toys, I don't want to move. But Dad says business isn't good during the recession. Whatever that means. Examine. I'm almost ready. It's time to go, Mr. Armstrong. No, Mr. Armstrong. Item found. 
What about you? The elephant? We had an elephant toy! See you soon, buddy. Safe travels, Mr. Armstrong. Your turn, Mr. Snouty. His name is Mr. Snouty. That's what's been chasing us all this time. What's that, Mr. Snouty? You don't want to go there. Huh. You're right. I'll hide you so you can stay with me. But you must stay quiet. Where will we hide, Mr. Snouty? Aha! Mom won't find you here. Shh! Ah! We're ready, Mom! Did you pack your toys yet, honey? I'm ready, Mom! Now we know where Mr. Snouty is. Yes. I didn't understand when I was a kid. My parents' business struggled, so we had to move out. I wonder what happened to Mr. Snouty. I know where Mr. Snouty is. He's in one of these rooms. Mr. Snouty... I'll take this bulb in case. Mr. Snouty... Wait, are we gonna offer Mr. Snouty to the altar? So that leads out. Where is Mr. Snouty? He's in one of these rooms, I just forgot which. Over here? Yep, I think it's over here. My oldest friend, Mr. Snouty. I know you're over here. Huh, it's a play tent from my childhood. Just gotta move this. Please don't be a man-eating elephant. Mr. Snouty. Whoa. Is that really you, Mr. Snouty? We got you now. Oh, fuck. Goddamn. Stop it. Stop it, gang. Please. Now we could head out and probably offer this to you whenever gods rule this place. Out we go. Just tippy-tapping our way out. Comfort! Don't jump scare, please. I don't need any of your vodka. We're trying to recover. Place on stone. Here we go. I'll just put you here, buddy. There you go. And what is happening to Mrs. Snouty? What is going on? Wait, what? Enter. <gasps> There's a dungeon! Loss. What? I saved the game, whatever that means. Another area? Ooh, hi. Hi there, cafe. Yikesers. Did we just sit down? Huh, this reminds me of my parents' coffee shop. Before they went bankrupt. Speaking of coffee, I could use some. That's why we love coffee. That's why it brings us so much comfort. Brown coffee brewed from the best of our beans. Please enjoy, sir. Thank you very much, sir. This is so comforting, question mark. We're just enjoying our coffee. Ah, uh, finally a moment of peace. And coffee, how I've missed you. Oh fucking hell, hi. You've always been watching us. Are you ready to confront me now? After all these years. Hi there. Uh, who are you? I am Loss. Loss. Yes, I'm here to help you. Please don't let my appearance scare you. Oh no, 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 it's not scary at all. My intentions are pure. But why loss? I am the creation of Agony. He may seem malicious, but he created me to reach you. I don't understand. Why are you here? I already told you. I'm here so you can confront me at last. I'm the loss you felt all those years ago. My parents? Yes, you were so young. Young and too proud. You ignored me, and that action created something else. Huh. I do miss my parents more than anything, but it was easier for me to not think about it. Why would I torture myself with a memory? It would never bring them back. Oh, so that's why we always saw the parents as ghosts, because they died when we were kids. You're not wrong. They're gone, but their memory is not. You need to treasure it. 
Do not avoid the thought of your parents. And that is why I was sent here. You need to go through me and deal with that was once forgotten. It's the only way. Okay, okay. How do I do that? You search yourself. You wake hope. You'll know when the time is right. Ah, uh, thanks! Thanks again, loss. And we're fading to black. Fading slowly to black, with the cafe slowly disappearing. Oh, okay, back to the psychiatrist. Last time you told me about your work and how it got the better of you. You had the chance to resign, but you did not. You kept working, even when it was burning you slowly from the inside. Today we're trying to delve deeper. We will find reasons behind your decisions. If you say so. Tell me, does it feel like you're in control? Ah, uh, yeah? I believe so. I mean, I struggle to stand behind my voice. Yes, I thought as much. I suppose you also feel insecure. Yeah, I don't feel like I have much left to give. What do you think? Why is your self-esteem so low? I wish I knew the answer. Tell me about your childhood. What would you like to hear? Just an overview, how was it? Hmm. I'm aware of the tragedy you had to face. Yeah, I do miss my parents. I had a happy childhood, but it ended way too soon. I'm sorry to hear that. Let's revisit that a little later. Could you tell me more about your parents? They were the best, kind and understanding. They owned the most idyllic coffee shop. I suppose that explains why I love coffee so much. Anyway, during the recession, their business started to struggle. It got to the point where we had to sell our house. Do you think these events have partially caused your urge for success? Probably. Ah, uh, our time seems to be up, Mr. Price. I'd like to hear more about your childhood during our next session. Hmm. I see. It's all coming back. All about the childhood. Completed chapter two. Open your eyes. Whoa! Chapter three. Forgiveness. Okay. So, this is where we'll end this episode of Distraint. If you guys enjoyed this episode, like, comment, and subscribe so we can grow our community together. And if you want to support our channel, become our patron at patreon.com backslash Gaming. It's about time that we reawaken hope, but until then, my name is Nez and thanks for watching. See you all next time. Bye, friendos!